Welcome to the Bro Beer Reviews, brah. Bro. <laughs> yeah. Bro. <laughs> bro. <laughs> On today's episode, we have New Belgium Day Blazer. <laughs> Day Blazer. <laughs> easy going ale. Is it easy going? <laughs> that's what it says. I mean, okay. that's what we're here to find out. This is coming in at 4.8% alcohol by volume. Yeah. Now, this is, uh, I mean, it's in the tall can. Yes. It was bought at a gas station. Yes, and there, it was in with the other bro beers. That's how I'm justifying it. Qualifies it qualifies. It qualifies. We'll just say it. We'll just say that. Yeah. <laughs> if not, I'll have to start another review series, like the Tall Boy <laughs> review, like Tall Bunyan Beer. Tall Bunyan? Instead of a bro beer, it'll be like the Tall Bunyan for the Tall Boy. <laughs> oh, man. It'll be big boy beer review. Yay! <laughs> big boy. We're big boys now. I have had uh oh god damn it these cans oh. never pour. Uh, I have had a few New Belgium beers. Mm -hmm. um, yes. I do enjoy New Belgium for the most they, part. They, they do fat tire, right? Fat tire. Yeah. yeah. Fat tire is pretty much their you know claim to fame. Sure. Uh, I've had a couple of them that are good, but they're one of those that they do too many weird IPA style flavors that. Yeah. Yeah. They're really hoppy. Yeah. And while they are called New Belgium, I mean, it's not like a Belgian brewery. Gotta point that out. I was already sold on it. It's like, hey, look, it's from Belgium. <laughs> made by Belgians. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's Colorado, that's right. Colorado, Colorado. there okay. you go. <clears throat> What's with, like, the Aztec, like, symbol on the front, too? It's, it's a like day a... blazer! Yeah, yeah. It's the day blazer symbol. Oh, boy. Come on, get with it, Luffy. I yeah, I guess I just you I know your day blazer lore. I didn't play that. <laughs> I didn't play that Halo. <laughs> Some of this shit. All right, there we go. I think this would be better a little bit colder. Yeah. Yeah, but a corniness. It is pretty easy going. Like when you first it hits your tongue, it's a, a little bit tart. Uh -huh. But then, like, as you drink it, it's like, oh, no, that's a wheat beer. And it's like... I was going to say, like, I got a little bit of that alfalfa aroma, but I don't really taste it. Yeah. Like, the follow-through is, like, almost like a... like a white... white beer. Yeah. Huh, yeah. White I, beer! I, I, I like the, the follow-up. I like the finish on it, because that, that's what makes it easy... easy drinking. Yeah, the finish is, is definitely better than what I get at the beginning. <laughs> Well, shit, am I hogging this? I think, I think, <clears throat> for chugging sake. Yeah, 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 let's even it out for chugging sake. Okay. Um, it is, uh, it's very uh, carbonated, but not in like the sharp carbonated way. It's kind of foamy. It's kind of foamy. You need to have a couple more instead of your hand there, Jacob. <laughs> yeah, seriously, what are you guys trying to do? I need to get some beer in me over here. I was going to die. <laughs> All right. I got the shakes. First impression is pretty good. Let's try chugging it. Yeah, right. Beep. <sighs> you get more of the beginning flavor when you chug it. Yeah. You don't have a lot of time for it to... <clears throat> it's that almost salty flavor to it. It's a little... Oh, weird. Kind of tart. It's like the it's Belgian sweet. Belgian fl flavor you get out of a Belgian beer, but it's like it e quickly dies off. Yeah. Turns into a wheat beer. It's uh, it's got a dual personality. That's what mm -hmm. I'm trying to say. Yeah, I don't, I don't I don't like it for a chugging beer. It's That's a little a clam beer. chowdery up front. <laughs> yeah. Is it that New England or New Belgium? New Belgium. Yes. It's not New England clam New chowder. Belgium clown clam chowder. <laughs> clown chowder. Yeah. Belgium <laughs> clam chowder. I would so eat that clown that's, chowder. That's a whole different category. <laughs> yeah. Right there. yeah, seriously. New Belgium <laughs> New Belgium clown chowder. chowder. Mm. <laughs> You're trying to tell me you never had a little bit of clown chowder? Come on. Hey, I mean, there was Come that on. time I was abducted when We've I was fired at the birthday party. We have all been there. Say not to the best of my knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you. It's happened. Half of those clowns do magic, so you probably had it too, bro. <laughs> You just didn't know it. What are they hiding in the big shoes? <laughs> oh, oh man. Chowder, right? <laughs> yeah. No, you know, the, the feet. The feet relate to something else, Wero, and that's where they store all the clown the big chowder. Nose, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. that's it. Mm. Yeah. 
<laughs> okay, anyway, back to the beer. <laughs> this is ostensibly a beer review. Um, oh, Day Glazer, New Belgium. It's not my favorite New Belgium beer, that's for sure. Yeah. But uh, when you are just sipping it, uh, imagine yourself, you know, hanging out in the mm. sun. Ooh. Having a nice like sit there, uh, that would be that would be wonderful. These would be good barbecue beers. It's not easy going because it's easy. It's easy going because that's how you want to be when you're drinking it. Yeah, oh, there yeah. You there you go. Perfect. You, you wanna... nailed their their motto right there. <laughs> yes. That's exactly what they were going for. Are you sure you don't work for New Belgium? <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> Give me the money. <laughs> right. Uh, yeah. I I don't know. It's just kind of. Middle of the road, I'd put it around a six and a half. I was gonna go six. I actually don't like this one. Whoa! I don't, I don't like it up front. Whoa! And, uh, even even if it's, <laughs> as it's walking away, I don't appreciate that view of it either. <laughs> so I'm giving this one a four. I, I mean, it's not terrible. I would drink it if it was handed to me, but I wouldn't personally buy it again. Wow. I think this is the first bit. I've actually liked something and Lofi hasn't <laughs> out of all these bro beers. Yeah. It's either it's like unanimous. You probably like, gave Camo a higher score. I think so. <laughs> wow. Yeah. That just lets you know how fucked up Dark Harder is. <laughs> Wait, what? I think I think the best use for this one is before you open it, you throw it at somebody else. <laughs> So you get the maximum velocity and, and mass. So much hate. It's not good. Wow. It's not good. Salty Lofi showed up. <laughs> I got that saltiness. <laughs> Is that the upfront saltiness? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> if you've ever tried uh, the Day Blaze, let us know what you think. If you have a favorite new Belgian beer, let us know what that is. And if you have any ideas for beers we need to try here on the Bro Beer Reviews. I mean, you don't even have to be a bro to recommend one. Let us know. Let us know. I have no way to prove that they're bro, so that's the whole thing. Oh. This has been <laughs> the Bro Beer Reviews. Please like, share, subscribe. Oh, Check out Lord. our social dates down below. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Yeah. <laughs>